Hi everyone, how you do? It's Joan from Joan Candy Artist and today I just thought I'd hop on and just show you how I frame my art. Now this one here is Billy, Billy No Mates, Billy No Mates Badger and he's going to be coming with me tomorrow. Um, this one is what's called, it's a G clay print. So I've had it printed in the gallery and it is, it's what you see in these big posh galleries. Um, and what I've done, this one is done on heritage watercolour paper. So it's a really high end watercolour paper. And Billy, he actually looks, what, what the, the thing about a G clay print is that um, because it's a really high quality print, this is what collectors go for. And the reason they go for it is because it's as near to the original as can be. Now, and quite honestly, that is so true because I must admit, sometimes I have to look twice and I've, I've ended up where I have almost sold an original because I thought um, it was a print. So anyway, just carrying on, just letting you know how I frame up um, these, these prints. What I do is, I'm going to show you on the back, what I use is this tape. Now it's acid free tape, okay? So that's what you have to think about whenever you decide to frame a piece yourself is to get acid free. Because if you don't have acid free, what can happen is it can damage the paper. Now, um, with a G clay print, the other thing is because uh, it won't fade, um, but it's also guaranteed to last for a lifetime. The gallery actually guaranteed me 200 years. I mean, that's incredible, really. So when I'm dead and gone, this will be worth an absolute fortune, <laughs> uh, providing that you look after it. So how you frame it up is you make sure to get acid free tape and then you put it across just in two places here. And you can see I've left a gap here. And it's not because I'm stingy with tape, it's because it's letting the air go through. <clears throat> and then what I do is I put a piece over it just to keep it down. Now, because it's also a special type of tape, you can get this on Amazon, just key in Amazon, um, acid free tape. Because it's... Um, acid free and it's a special tape it sticks so in years to come hopefully you know i won't 100 percent guarantee but hopefully it won't start falling off and peeling away the other thing i will let you know is that you don't stick it on the bottom you see that so it's got some air around it because what happens is if people try and if you put tape on the top and on the bottom what can happen is that when uh, you've got obviously got different conditions. You've got hot and cold conditions. It the paper will swell. It will then go back to normal. So um, so you want to be able to allow it to breathe. So I hope that helps. If you ever decide to frame up your work, um, or frame up um, you know some prints that you buy, I I think I think people probably prefer them. Uh, when they buy a piece to have it already framed. I'd love to know in the comments, what's your thoughts? Do you prefer to buy a piece that you know you can just hang up or do you prefer to choose your own frame um, and, uh, and frame it yourself? Well, if you do, that's the best way that I know of how to do it. So I'd love to know what you think. So I'm going to, s I sell both framed and unframed. On that note, I'm going to go and carry on. Bye now.